guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel, Adventures with Jossie. I'm here with Pika. Hey guys, I'm Petite Pika. You can find me at twitch.tv slash Petite Pika. You can find me on Instagram, TikTok, and Twitter as well. But I met Jose last year yes. here at Retropalooza, yes. and now we're back together again, and she has some questions for me. Okay. Um, how did you become a Twitch influencer? Yeah, so um, in 2020, COVID happened, mm -hmm. and um, at that time, I had a really old gaming PC, and I had an okay microphone and I had a webcam mm -hmm. and so like everybody else I was bored at home and just started Doing streaming on Twitch. Yeah. Did, um, when you were little did you like video games? Yeah I loved video games. Um, I still love video games now. I'm in my mid-20s mm -hmm. now and um, my very first console was the first um, Nintendo system so the oh. Nintendo um, yes. Entertainment System or NES um, and uh, yeah I've had almost every single console like from Nintendo and from PlayStation ever since then and now a gaming PC. So. Gaming PC. What, um, which games uh, were your favorite? So <laughs> my absolute favorite game when I was um, a kid was on the Nintendo GameCube oh, and, it yes. was, and it was Luigi's Mansion. Oh yes, yeah. that's my favorite, it's, Luigi's. It's so good. I thought it was like Luigi's time to shine. Mm -hmm. And, yes. I, and I loved like the little crying toads like that you would find throughout the Haunted Mansion and it was cool because it was Luigi saving his brother. It was just such a different story that I loved it. I know, I think like um like even me, like I like I mean like I think we're always gonna be fans of Mario and Luigi. Yeah. I think that's just like, you know, I don't think it would ever go out of style. I think it would yeah. always be like forever fan. Yeah, it's very very <laughs> classic. Yeah, the characters are gonna age like very well. And they have. So, do you plan on um, being a Twitch uh, influencer for a long time, or um, you know, everything willing? Um, I, I like to think I'm a lucky person sometimes, so I hope so. You know, yes. so long as people will put up with my shenanigans mm -hmm. for a while. But yeah, I really do love it. Um, like people come in and say like it makes them happy, but at the end of the day, it makes me it makes me very very happy to do it. So, how do you like um, the idea of like you know having been the influencer? Um, traveling from um, one state or one city to another, is it like, do you like it? Is it like um, something like interrupts your work or do you just have it? So, um, so sometimes I'll go like as Pika or as just like me as like a person to like at a convention or something like that. Um, I think it's a little bit of both. So the only negative part is that I'm away from streaming, you know, streaming. so I, I miss my community and I miss playing games and I miss you know, turning on the camera, but then I'm here with like friends like Joseph and yeah. I get to see you again. Oh, you're so and great. and you know that's honestly the best part. So it's very balanced. But um at the end of the day if I can see you know Joseph and you know friends like Royce mm -hmm. and you know other people at other conventions and that's what makes it worthwhile. That's so it. yeah. The rewarding. Yes. Yeah. Okay, well thank you for your time Pika. Yeah. Oh I enjoy gosh. um I enjoy. I've been wanting to do this interview, so like oh I finally gosh, got the opportunity. You're so sweet. Oh my gosh! No, no, no! You're amazing. Thank I you so much got the opportunity for, for thank finding you. me. I was so happy to meet you last year, and um, you guys better hit subscribe, okay? Or I will find you, and you'll have to answer to me. I'm much scarier than Jose. She's a lot nicer. You should give her a follow. Make sure you subscribe uh, to her YouTube channel, Adventures with Jose, and maybe you'll see me again next year with her. So yeah. Thank, thank you again. You. No, thank you. Oh my gosh, you're amazing. <laughs> Yay!